it is a proven specialist for the trades, commerce and service. The success of the Mercedes-Benz Vito is based on strengths such as versatility, flexibility and a balanced price-performance ratio. Extensively updated, the new version is now even more attractive. The designers have modified the distinctive and dynamic design of the Mercedes-Benz Vito. For instance, the new Vito can be identified by the restyled radiator grille, which is coupled with the special equipment items Distronic, Active Brake Assist, or Painted Bumpers. The Mercedes star plate is centrally positioned in the radiator grille and surrounded by three black grained loops. A radiator grille in a chrome design is also available as an option for all Vito models, the lubes are then in a chrome look. Thanks to its versatility the Vito is an established partner for SMEs, in particular those with up to five vehicles. More than 70% of all Mercedes-Benz Vito vehicles are used in such conditions. The designers have also updated the Vito in the interior. The robust and elegant fabric Kaluma fabric replaces the previous fabric Tunja fabric. The facelift brings new air vents and a sporty turbine look on the left and right hand edge of the instrument panel. In conjunction with the optional chrome package, the central dashboard is now framed by an element in a high quality piano lacquer look. With this option the frames of the new air vents are also in chrome. The Vito also demonstrates its diversity in other areas. For instance, it is the only model in its class to be available in a choice of three lengths, two wheelbases, and three drive systems. With a payload of up to 3018 pounds, it is also the giant in its class. The wide diversity of variants make it a partner for a large range of trades. As a panel van it reliably meets all requirements in goods and freight transportation. Almost as frequently it is used as a mobile parts store and service vehicle. The Mercedes-Benz Vito Tour, on the other hand, predominantly transports people and goods, often also in factory traffic. The Vito Mixto bridges the gap between the panel van and tour. It is particularly suitable for mobile tradespeople teams. Last but not least, customers can choose from different equipment packages. For example, the Vito Tourer is available with the lines Base, Pro or Select. In view of its use as a commercial vehicle, the optional equipment of the Vito is particularly diverse. There are numerous door and window variants or roof rails with carrier bars. The load compartment can be fitted with a wooden floor, a rail system for load anchoring, lashing rails on the sidewall, and interior paneling. These options provide a maximum of functionality. In the panel van a new optional and hard-wearing lightweight construction floor made of plastic plays fully to its strengths compared with the standard metal load compartment floor and increases the payload leeway by 26 to 33 pounds compared with the wooden floor. Roof attachments, carrier systems and load compartment trays are either available ex-factory or as accessories. More comfort and easier handling come courtesy of the rail system in the Vito Tour, which can be used to move the rear bench seats in the rear effortlessly. Active Brake Assist, Distronic and the digital inside rear view mirror extend the range of safety assistance systems for the new Vito from the previous 10 to 13 systems. This sees the Vito continuing the tradition of redefining safety standards in its segment. The Vito panel van was the first van to be equipped as standard, with airbags and seat belt reminders on both the driver's and co-driver's side. And with crosswind assist and attention assist among the standard equipment, five years ago the Vito already redefined safety standards in its segment.
Under the hood, there are 1.7 and 2.0 liter four cylinder diesel engines from the OM622 and OM654 families. They are available in multiple outputs, including 101 horsepower and 199 pounds foot of torque, 134 horsepower and 243 pounds foot of torque, 161 horsepower and 280 pounds foot of torque as well as 188 horsepower and 324 pounds foot of torque. Customers seeking more performance can opt for the Vito 124 CDI, which has 236 horsepower and 369 pounds foot of torque. While it's no sports car, the van can accelerate from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 7.9 seconds and hit a top speed of 130 miles per hour. For the first time the 9G Tronic automatic transmission is now available without restrictions for all Vito variants, with rear-wheel drive. The especially comfortable and efficient automatic transmission, with torque converter, replaces the 7G Tronic, and was previously reserved for the Vito Tour. Drivers can use the dynamic select switch to select the drive program's comfort and sport, and thus tailor the shifting behavior to their driving requirements. Alternatively, they can shift manually in M mode using direct select steering wheel gear shift paddles. With the new Airmatic, the Vito is once again broadening its already white application spectrum. Because whether it is a bumpy rural road or a perfectly flat motorway, Available for the first time in the Vito, E-Vito, V-Class and EQV, from October 2020, the air suspension system Airmatic adjusts the suspension to the prevailing conditions. Thanks to increased ground clearance, the ride comfort is retained even on rough terrain. Damping is regulated for each individual wheel automatically to suit the current driving situation and the state of the road. This is done rapidly and precisely, using two separate valves for the rebound and compression forces in the dampers. Thus the Airmatic provides you with the highest degree of driving comfort for every situation. Comfort-orientated basic springing turns into safe driving stability with increasing speed. The separate setting of the rebound and compression phase via one valve respectively results in calmer handling. By combining safety and comfort in this groundbreaking way, Mercedes-Benz Vans is assuming a pioneering role in the segment of midsize vans. Thanks to intuitive operation via the dynamic select switch in the center console, the driver can quickly and easily choose from three different drive programs. One program for raises the vehicle by up to 1.3 inch at a speed of up to 18 miles per hour. At faster speeds the vehicle automatically returns to the normal level. In the Comfort Drive program the vehicle remains at standard height. If the Vito reaches a speed of 68 miles per hour, the van autonomously lowers by 0.4 inch in order to optimize consumption. In the Sport program the vehicle is lowered by 0.4 inch, irrespective of the speed. Irrespective of the selected drive program the pneumatic level control is active fully automatically and irrespective of the load. This ensures significantly more driving stability, including in trailer operation. The Airmatic is available for all passenger car variants of the new Vito in conjunction with the OM654 engine. Since its launch, the Mercedes-Benz Vito has been the epitome of a versatile mid-size van. More than 508,000 units of this current third generation have been sold since its introduction in autumn 2014. As of last year, customers now also have a whole host of new configuration options for the exterior of all Vito models. The color palette for metallic paint finishes was extended to include graphite gray and selenite gray. Plus, the well-loved hyacinth red metallic familiar from Mercedes-Benz passenger cars was also added to the selection list for all models. Equally new is the optional steel blue paint finish. 
For those who want a striking and dynamic appearance, a number of new light alloy wheels has been available since the start of 2019. A 10 spoke 19 inch light alloy wheel design painted in black with a high sheen finish, as well as two 18 inch light alloy wheels, one with a 5 twin spoke design in tremolite gray with high sheen finish, and one with a 5 spoke design in black, also with a high sheen finish. What's more, 17 inch light alloy wheels painted in black have also been added to the scope of available equipment. The 17-inch variant is designed in such a way that it offers improved vehicle aerodynamics. The 2020 Vito will go up for order on April 1, and German pricing starts at $24,500.